Good afternoon. I'm Mike O'Brien, Canada Regional Sales Manager for Blucher, a watch brand. Thank you for joining us today. Now that restrictions are easing and construction sites are opening up again, you may find that you're under pressure to make up for lost time. Perhaps you'll have a smaller crew or some of the skilled trades that are in high demand are not readily available. Or like a project that uh, I'm supplying, the owner still wants us to meet the uh, the original deadline despite the government shutting down all construction sites for two months. So today let's discuss ways to get back some of that time with the Blucher products. So Blucher is a watch brand specializing in stainless steel drainage solutions. Uh, the product offers a complete line of pipe and fittings, uh, floor drains, channel or trench drains, and of course the Hygienic Pro line uh, which is designed specifically for food, beverage, pharmaceutical, or any industry that really is uh, concerned with, uh, with hygiene. Uh, so one of the first ways we can help you is we have inventory. We, uh, uh, we have significant inventory in the USA, both in North Carolina and Nevada, uh, and there are significant volumes of that. Uh, we have miles of pipe in stock in, uh, in all sizes. We have tens of thousands of different fittings, again, in, in all different sizes. Uh, we have floor drains and, and clean outs and shower channels, kitchen channels. And we even have a variety of stainless steel trench drains available to ship immediately. In our BT series of trench drains, we are stocking both 6 inch and 12 inch channels in standard sizes with most grading options and both uh, center and outlet uh, uh, or end outlet locations. So. Uh, we likely have something that will work for you. And of course, we, uh, we're still stocking the Hygienic Pro line of, of drains. Uh, the most common sizes being the 8, 11, 15, and 18 foot trenches with both center and, uh, and end outlet. And of course, the Hygienic Pro spot drain. Uh, these uh, come complete with the Hygienic grates and, and, uh, and a basket. And they also save you a lot of time because they're designed to be quick and easy to install with with uh, filler channels to allow for a nice tie into the uh, uh, to your finished floor. Uh, and in addition to that, we're also producing trench drains and channel drains in t in Texas. So we have domestic manufacturing. If uh, if your project requires something other than the, the products we have in stock, uh, this allows us to shorten our our lead times on some of those made-to-order products. So. <clears throat> But perhaps the most significant impact on your timeline would come from the use of Blucher Europipe for your DWV systems compared to stainless steel or cast iron pipe. Uh, the Blucher system it's a, is a push fit system, requires no special tools for installing. There's tremendous labor savings uh, when you don't have to weld the pipe and not to mention there's no hot work, uh, which means there's no fire watch. It's near, uh, nearly a third of the weight of traditional piping material uh, it's uh, very easy to install and requires a, a, a hanger or a bracket only about every 10 feet or so. It's, uh, it's a complete offering uh, running from 1.5 inch diameter uh, right up through 12 inch diameter and 316 L stainless steel. Of course stainless steel is non-combustible, it's corrosion resistant, hygienic, has a long product life, quick installations, easy maintenance, there's multiple joint options to match any application and it's lightweight. Uh, we have all the fittings to go with it, bends, branches, couplings or jointing sockets. There's access pipes, uh, reducers, increasers, adapters, plugs, accessories, all designed to assist with a quick installation. <clears throat> when you build with Blucher pipe you get a long-lasting syst drainage system that is safe and efficient. And we have all become more aware of hygiene recently and it will quickly become one of the most important factors in facility design and construction. An important feature of Blucher piping system is the pickling process. Pickling is a cleaning and passivation process in acid baths where the steel product is cleaned of any impurities and then quickly oxidized to form the chromium oxide uh, coating that uh, makes stainless steel stainless. In a Blucher pipe system, every piece and weld is, is put through this process at the factory. Uh, by comparison, site welding without this step often adds impurities that will lead to uh, corrosion, 
as uh, uh, though the, that process can take place on site, it is very time consuming and, and labor labor intensive. Some advantages, push fit doesn't require specialized labor. Uh, prefabricated fittings with drainage shape and, and smooth inside surface. Uh, there's heat expansion in, built into the socket so you don't have to worry about uh, uh, thermal shock. All the parts have been leak tested at the factory. All welds are made uh, in the factory with protection gas and, and of course they're all, uh, they're all pickled beforehand. As compared to a welded system where you know those welds uh, likely aren't uh, uh, aren't being protected on site. Uh, if they are, it, it requires specialized tooling, and and uh, and it is very time consuming. Um, it's also expensive and can still be prone to to corrosion in the field after the fact. So, a real advantage in in the longevity of the of the piping system when you use the Blue Europite. One man could install the system alone. Uh, you can easily carry a 10 foot section of pipe as you see in the bottom right hand corner there. Uh, and, and you know, that allows you to possibly even assemble sections on a bench and carry them to the, uh, to the installation point. Uh, saving you a little bit of time and, and uh, therefore uh, some money and expense. Installation is quite simple. Uh, you know, you, the pipe cutter, uh, cuts and bevels the pipe all in one step. Uh, you, once you've done, once you've cut the pipe to the correct size, you, you take a look and make sure that the sealing ring is in place, place correctly, bevel the opposite piece of uh, pipe and insert, and there's still a little bit of room in there for adjustment and expansion and contraction of the joint. Uh, I do have uh, a couple of pieces of pipe here, so I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go and, uh, and we'll put this together uh, uh, together online here. So, so I have uh, I have a wide a branch type fitting, and I have a, a two inch section of pipe. In the fitting, I can see that uh, uh, I can see that the, the the ceiling ring is in incorrectly. There's a, a lip on that ceiling ring that uh, that goes uh, the the points down. That allows the 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 pipe that's going in it to to um, uh, to, to slide in a little bit easier, but then that lip stops it from pulling out. So, so what I've done is I've taken some uh, lubricant to this side, to the to the beveled end, and I just worked that into place and and slide it in. You can see it was it was very quick, a couple of seconds, and now that it's in, it's in there tight. There is a little bit of a, a movement available if you needed to say adjust a fitting. Um, when you once you got it to to, to site, but it's in there. It, it's solid. The uh, lubricant uh, has a little bit of alcohol in it, uh, not for drinking, but for um, uh, what happens is that alcohol evaporates uh, after a couple of hours, and then that that joint is solid. So uh, it's a, a very simple and a very solid connection. Moving along. So we talked about the pipe cutters. We have a pipe cutter program available for you. Uh, we have manual cutters for up to 12 inch pipe and we also have electric cutters for the two inch to through six inch pipe. So your local rep will have details on that uh, and they are available uh, for you to use. This is a, a picture of the, of the uh, manual pipe cutter kit. You clamp the uh, you clamp the device in, in in a vise, and it works similar to a large uh, a large tube cutter. There's adapters to uh, to adapt for the different diameters. And this is a, a couple of pictures of the electric cutter. Again, ad adapters to uh, uh, accept the various diameters of pipe, and this one will clamp to a bench or a stand in place. So. The ceiling rings are, uh, uh, I mentioned when we checked for that to make sure that they're in the right, in the correct place. If you look at the, the little diagram at the top right that shows a, a cross section profile of the ceiling ring and that, uh, that little lip, you can see it'll bend out of the way as we're pushing the, as we're pushing the pipe into the, into the, uh, uh, the socket end of the, of the other pipe. Uh, but then in the photograph, you'll see where it's compressed together and uh, I'm not sure how well that shows up, but you can see a little line at uh, uh, oh, my 
my pointer isn't showing up on there, but there is a little line where you can see that the the lip has has kind of compressed there, and, and it's going to uh, it's really going to hold that uh, connection in place. So the ceiling rings come in a, a three different materials. Uh, the standard is EPDM. It's a it's a black uh, a, a black ring. It has EPDM is has excellent chemical resistance. Handles temperatures up to 212 degrees Fahrenheit, 100 degrees Celsius, and it's suitable for most applications. Uh, the other two, there's an MBR. Uh, Material which would be suitable for for hydrocarbons, for instance, if you had uh, uh, oil or, or gasoline uh, in your uh, in your waste, then you would want to look at the at the NBR. And then uh, uh, for high temperature or very aggressive uh, uh, applications, there is the Viton or, or FPM material, and that can handle up to 395 degrees Fahrenheit or 200 degrees Celsius. Where you might see that is is in a French fry facility or a a chicken nugget facility where they have fryers and, and uh, there could be hot oil. The oil can, can actually get much hotter than, uh, uh, than water, so you want to make sure that the, uh, that the ceiling rings are, are suited for that temperature. So. Now the Blucher Europipe is designed as a drainage system as opposed to a pressure system, uh, but it can handle some pressure. Uh, with just the ceiling ring, it's rated up to 7 psi or, or half a bar. Uh, would likely handle more, but that's what uh, what our published data is. Uh, with the addition of a joint clamp, the max pressure could be as high as uh, as 30 psi or two bar. Uh, the the joint clamp is the uh, is the picture at the top uh, top right. <clears throat> and if uh, if you need to go to th to three bar or 44 psi, uh, the clamping ring in a, in addition to projections, which are achieved using that. The dimple tool, the, the little device at the bottom right there, uh, you, you can you can get up to uh, those types of pressures. So certainly we can handle the, the types of uh, types of things that you're going to see in a drainage system, and uh, on the off chance that you're you're looking at a vacuum drainage system, the, this will handle uh, handle that no problem. So. So we know it's a great product. It's been uh, in production for over 40 years. It's very common uh, in European construction where buildings are designed and expected to last for centuries. And, and yes, it has a premium price. Uh, however, uh, the material cost is only one part of the total installed cost of a drainage system. There are sig significant savings in labor. Uh, this diagram is from a case study and, and it is available at blucherpipe.com. The project in this case was uh, uh, a pair of identical ships which gave the rare opportunity for an apples to apples comparison. <clears throat> in this project there were 7,000 connections to be made. A good welder could complete uh, 48 uh, connections per day uh, and of course at the skilled labor rate. A general labor at a, at a lower wage rate and with Approximately 10 minutes of uh, instruction was able to complete up 480 connections a day. Uh, the savings in time and labor are significant. The job with the Blucher pipes was completed in 15 days. Uh, with the welded pipe, it was 146 days. Think about how much time you have estimated to weld the drainage system together on your project. In this example, it was only 10% of the time. For uh, for the Blucher uh, installation, as it was for the uh, for the welded installation. So, what could that mean for your project? If you had scheduled, say, a month to weld to weld together the drainage system, and you could get back three and a half weeks of that, uh, and and then pour the concrete floor sooner, you know, what would that do to your schedule? What what would that do for your bottom line? And lastly, we have some resources available for you. Uh, Revit drawings are available at the BIM store. Uh, again, makes it easy to incorporate those into your, uh, uh, into your uh, project specifications. Uh, you can also refer to blucherpipe.com, blucherpipe.ca in Canada. We have literature, we have spec sheets, case studies, uh, installation instructions and videos, uh, price lists and catalogs. So uh, everything that you really need to get, uh, to get going. As I mentioned at the start, Blucher is a brand of the Watts Water, of Watts Water Technologies and uh, together the Watts brands have over a thousand years of uh, experience and, and all of us uh, at Watts are ready and, uh, and here to help you with your next project. So 
if, uh, if you have any questions on this, uh, uh, feel free to reach out to me. <clears throat> My email address uh, here at the, at the bottom is uh, michael.obrien at uh, wattswater.com. Uh, I also have, uh, <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I also have colleagues in the U.S. Uh, uh, if you don't have their contact information, I certainly get it, uh, get it to you. Uh, but in closing, I'm right at 15 minutes. I'd like to thank you for joining us today. I hope I've given you some ideas that uh, are useful. And like I said, if we can help in any way, please reach out. Have a great day.